I'm trying to connect with people. And if you like it, great. If you don't like it, that's okay too. I also love how honest you always are with your followers. Like you were saying on Instagram or whatever, you're always telling us about your journey and letting us follow along. How do you handle like the haters when they say a rude comment? Um, I think, I think a lot of what I'm learning because I, I think I'm still learning about it is, um, just be really confident and, and sure about what you're doing. If you're not doing anything wrong, if you're not hurting anybody and you're really, really confident about that, they can't make you feel bad. They can't, they really can't. You know, I've, I've had in the past of opening up and, you know, talking about like, for example, the miscarriages last year and people will blame you or the like, you have too many kids. And it was funny cause like I was the, and you know, other mothers will relate to this. There's like a magical age of 35 where everybody all of a sudden calls you old. Now before 35, you're very young. And then once you're 35, you have AMA, advanced maternal age. It's actually like a, a medical, this medical jargon, advanced maternal age. So you go from, there's no middle age. You go from young to old and they're like, oh, well, it's because you're 35. <laughs> and then they're like, now they're like, wow, you're having a baby at 36. That's so old. And I'm like, you know what? Just, just stop. And I know, I mean, I, I, it's just, it's, the things that people come up with are, are so ridiculous, you know? I mean, people will, um, the, my one that I'm working on emotionally, like personally right now too, is, you know, certain brands that I decide to team up with, partnerships. And people come on, they want to make you feel like you're a bad person for teaming up with brands. And I'm like, these are things that I love and I support. And I would love, to, you know, having them come to me and say, hey, do you want to work together? That's amazing, you know. I'm in, I'm I'm so proud of that, and I'm excited to tell everybody about it. It's not like I'm like ha ha ha. Here's this horrible thing that I'm going to try to sell you, you know. So like you know, there was a, somebody who wrote me yesterday, and I responded to them, and I said, you know what? I'm really proud of this, and so that's going to be my that that's my my new one. It's kind of like with my work, don't shame me, don't mm -hmm. shame me. I'm working too hard. I am here trying to take care of my kids, trying to teach my kids, trying to take care of a new baby, trying to keep everybody in my family safe during a pandemic, you know, and, and I'm trying to work on top of that. Do not mom shame me. Do not work shame me. I am doing my very, very best. And I have no sleep on top of that. <laughs> I know. I know you are the clap back queen. So you, what does it take for you to respond to someone? And like, do you laugh it off or does it ever actually really get to you when a troll comes for you? Um, I think I, it used to get to me a, a mm -hmm. lot, you know, um, and, and you just really have to, uh, you know, I had to get more in touch with, with me and my comfort level with what I was doing. And I, and it, I mean, yeah, like the, the reason I bring up yesterday is that would make me feel bad. It's like, oh, you know, they'll tell you a sellout and all this kind of stuff. And like, but, but no, that's not how I look at it at all. I'm not gonna come to your work and say, hey, how dare you? I'm also not like putting a gun to your head and being like, follow me. You know what I mean? It's just yeah. a choice. It is a choice to come on and see my life and see my family and see the things that I like and I don't like. And and you know what, it, some of it is my job as well. Not a job that I don't like. I feel very lucky, I love my job. Yeah. And I get to choose. They're not coming to a, with a gun to my head saying, hey, you have to work with me or else. It's a choice that I'm making. And so for me to reach in and sort of say, hey, this is something I believe in and there's no reason that, that you or any other person can make me feel bad about it. The, the thing that you have to do though, was, do you call it clock back queen? Is that the word you use, yeah. the word clock back? Okay, <laughs> clock back queen. When you clock back, what I always try to do is I always try to do it with positivity because I want to make the situation better, not worse. And I realize that some people are coming to me because they're trying to be mean. Some people are coming to me because they genuinely want to know. And you know what, that's okay too. That's okay too. They don't know me. They don't know my life and, ex and, and experience. They read a lot of magazines that maybe are, are really not very nice. And that's the way that they can, that they are uh, raised in their world. You know what I mean? And so for me, if, if they come to me and I explain it to them, well, this is the reason why I do it. This is the reason why I post pictures of my kids. This is the reason why I want to team up with this brand. This is the reason I go back to exercising as for them. Whatever, whatever it is, this is the reason I want to have a big family that I don't have, I don't need to hide my reasons because there's nothing wrong with my reasons. And so the way that I try to talk with somebody is always trying to think, what's the result that I want? I want to explain myself, explain my reasoning, not shame, put my foot down though, protect myself, protect my family, 
and then try to think like could we bond afterwards mm -hmm. do you know what i mean i'm not trying to 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 close you away uh, then i'll just block you and i do that yeah. too if i don't want to have a conversation with you if i just want to you know alienate you i'll just block you it's at least your your very long comment that you thought about read it to your friends and then posted and it's just one button and it's like okay done wow that was like five minutes of your time that is no is now in delete land you know yeah